Hey, what's going on everyone? This is Ari Views back with another video and today I will show you guys how to lock any of your iPhone apps with a passcode, face ID or touch ID. Whichever authentication method you use for your iPhone, you can use that to lock any app you want on your iPhone. This is super easy to do and now with iOS 15.4, this method just got even better. Now, of course, we know that Apple doesn't actually offer a feature that would let you actually lock any app you want with a passcode or face ID, but there are always, of course, different methods you can use. And this one is by far the easiest and the best one that you can use to lock any app you want with a passcode, face ID or touch ID. The first thing you want to do is open the shortcuts app. You don't need to install anything here at all. All you have to do is just create a simple automation. Go to the automation section and tap on create personal automation. Right here, scroll down and choose app. Once you go here, choose the apps that you want to actually lock. You tap on the apps right there. You can select any app you want, the amount of apps you want. And you can also change this later very, very easily. Change, of course, the list of the apps that you have locked. I will show you guys how to do that in a second. So tap done right here and tap on next. Then what you need to do is tap on add action and search for a start timer. So here we have start timer. Tap on it. You can see right here where it says minutes. Tap on it and choose seconds. Then right here where it says 30. Tap on it and just add one and you're good to go. Tap next. Disable this. And here's the great feature of iOS 15.4. Notify when run. Now you can actually disable this so it won't give you a notification at all when this automation will run. So nobody will actually know what is happening. It won't get a notification, which of course it will do on earlier iOS versions. It will simply just lock the apps without a notification at all. And that is super cool. Now tap done. And you're good to go. What you need to do next is just head on to the clock app. And from here, make sure you go to timer and tap right here when timer ends. And just make sure you have selected stop playing and tap on set. And now you're good to go. You have locked the apps. Here we have locked calculator and the calendar. And you will notice once I open the calculator app in one second, it will lock out of the app. Just like that, you can see it will actually lock the app. Go right here to the lock screen. You can see, of course, where we now need to enter the passcode or the face ID in order to get access to that app. So let's just add the passcode here. And you can see once I add the passcode, it will actually unlock the app. And of course, we can work on it anything we want. That is how you lock any app you want. But what if you just want to remove the lock from any app or add other apps? Simply head on back to the shortcuts app. Go to the automation that you have created and tap right here where any of two apps are opened right there. Choose the apps from here. And now, of course, you can go ahead and add more apps here. Tap done. You can add or remove any apps you want. Click back here. Click done. And you're good to go. You have now edited the list of the apps that you have locked. So just like that, as simple as that, you can lock any app you want with Face ID, Touch ID, or Passcode. So that is it for this video, guys. I hope you guys enjoyed the video. Leave a like if you did. And of course, don't forget to subscribe for more videos. And we'll see you guys on the next one.